GoToMeeting. This episode of The Young Turks is brought to you by GoToMeeting. Online meetings made easy. I know karate. We have another uh, gay-hating Republican. Of course! <laughs> All right, but this one uh, wanted to do a little commentary on the new TSA pat-downs. You know, the advanced pat-downs where there's a little jiggly-wiggly going on. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> anyway, um, so this is a Republican lawmaker in Washington State. Uh, his name is Eugene Delgadio. And um, he thinks that the TSA pat-downs are uh, an example of widespread homosexual agenda. Well, obviously. Right. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, where do they get these guys? Really? Really? Like, so somehow the homosexuals <laughs> captured the entire government. And then they planted the Christmas Day bomber with the underwear in his pants, <laughs> right? And then they're like, perfect. Okay, next, spring into action, and everybody get jiggy. <laughs> okay, I mean, how insane do you have to be able to do that? All right, go ahead. So he says um, that, first of all, the TSA's non-discrimination hiring policy is the federal employee's version of the gay bill of special rights. <laughs> So he's against all equal opportunity employment. Of okay? course, obviously. Gays should not be employed, okay? No one should give them jobs. No, he obviously. continues to say, that means the next TSA official that gives you an enhanced pat-down could, could be a practicing homosexual secretly getting pleasure from your submission. <laughs> so this guy's into, like, those, these S&M games or something. I didn't even, didn't even think about that. <laughs> like, meanwhile, he's thinking, oh, when they grab me, they're thinking, submit, submit. <laughs> Look, dude, nobody's interested in your junk. I mean, really, he thinks the gays are like, oh, dude, did you, did you just check out this dude? Right. Ooh, let's hatch a plot. It's really complicated and involves terrorists. But eventually, we'll get this guy to submit to us feeling his junk. Yeah, that's probably what happened. Ugh, disaster. I just don't know what goes through these people's minds. Um, and then he is also against the fact that uh, Congress promotes same-sex marriages, obviously. Of course. And um, this, is, this is another quote that I loved. He said that uh, gay adoptions for, yeah, gay adoptions will lead to men hand-in-hand hand skipping down to adoption centers to pick out a little boy for themselves. Uh, He's so, he, how perverted is that, though? Like, that's what's going through his mind. No, 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 this guy, there's a lot of things going through this guy's mind. Right. He's like, oh, they want me to submit, do they? <laughs> and then they go get boys? Oh, no, that's so dirty. Oh, I can't believe they came up with this plan. Where do I sign up? I mean, tsk, tsk, tsk. <laughs> By the way, uh, when I was going through security, I saw a mildly attractive woman that was doing TSA. Mm -hmm. Now, they, unfortunately, uh, because of the homosexual agenda, obviously, it's only same-sex pat-downs, right? Right. But I thought, look, if she was going to pat me down... You'd be okay with it. I was like, oh, oh, I forgot my watch on and my cell phone. Oh, did it beep? I guess you're going to have to do an advanced pat-down. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, as you can tell, straight people are much more skeevy. No, everybody's the same, of course. Everybody's the same level of skeeviness. But I, I have said in the past, forget all this nonsense this guy's talking about. Mm -hmm. But with the advanced pat-downs, you're going to get guys who are into advanced pat-downs. Right. Like, you know what I'm saying? People will sign up. It's, the TSA, you know, didn't, isn't a hotbed of guys who are into advanced pat-downs now. But now that it exists, it's like the shoe fetish guys uh, that are all, every single shoe salesman you have, ladies, is, it has a shoe fetish. Mm -hmm. Okay. Because where are they going to go? They're going to be a mechanic? They could be. Mm -hmm. but they're like, on the other hand, I could be putting shoes on women's feet every day. Young Turks have a new sponsor, GoToMeetings. Online meetings made incredibly simple. You can set it up in two minutes and you can talk to anyone from anywhere. And it's only $49 a month and it's unlimited. You can actually go to gotomeeting.com slash Turks and get a 30-day trial. I never heard anybody.